Hey, how's it going guys? Technotos here, and I'm hoping you guys are having a fantastic Friday because my Friday is getting pretty shitty right now. My camera's all busted up. I got an SD card there that caused the entire thing, and I got my little multi-tool that I did highlight in another video. We're gonna be testing a couple things here, but first of all, my camera is dead. I'm gonna be have to picking up another one. And sorry about this informal video here. It's more gonna be like a vlog because I'm gonna show you guys what's going on. I did have something lined up pretty nice for you guys here regarding this bottle, but we're gonna be skipping that for now and we're gonna try to resolve all this. Before we begin, I am gonna be uh, seeing what's inside this SD card and see if I can recover anything. If I can't, we'll open it up and we'll see what's inside an SD card. I did have the SD card just sitting way inside there and then I received some kind of message on the screen saying that I needed to reinsert my SD card another time. After trying to take it back out, it got jammed halfway. I'm not too sure what's going on inside there now, but it's recognizing that there's an SD card already inside. So I think that something's going on inside there and there's probably a little piece of this that's stuck inside. I tried to use this uh, little, um, I can't even remember what this is called anymore, but uh, tried picking up inside there, try to pick out the pieces, but my camera wouldn't recognize, so it seems like it's busted now. Um, we're gonna bring it to a camera shop and see what we can do with this, because it does cost a lot of money. This is the whole thing that caused the problem. I did have just a little 32 gigabyte sand disk, um, which is not important. I can pick up another one really soon. And this is the piece that got lodged inside. So I don't even know what's inside um, the SD card. And I'm sure a lot of us are wondering. So what we're going to do here today is we're going to actually just cut it up and we're going to see what's inside. So since this is already busted up and I can't really recover anything inside, I'm pretty curious as to what's really inside a sand disk or inside a regular SD card. Now I'm going to hold this up and use this as a screen grab and I can use it as a thumbnail. And I'm sure a lot of you guys will get interested in this. Or not, who knows, but we're gonna rip this apart and see what's inside. So the first top half of it seems like it's the contact point that actually touches inside the camera. And then we already have that out. And you have these little grill thing right at the bottom, which sits just like this, I believe, right there. What I find really odd is once the thing sits inside here just like this, the contact point really doesn't do anything. It's just pure plastic down there. If I can get it in the light position, you guys can definitely see that this is just plastic. So. What we're gonna do here is we're just gonna rip this apart and we'll check out what's inside. Force it out. And it seems like there's nothing guys, so very weird. So this is the only part that actually has the entire storage size inside. I'm so surprised right now that it comes out like this. Wow, what the hell? And um, yeah, these contact points, and you guys are gonna see they're pretty worn out because I've been using this SD for a while now. But apparently this has 32 gigs inside, so if you guys are interested in this video, please drop a thumbs up and I will be doing a bunch more of these sort of like what's inside kind of thing. And I'm going to check out what's inside 128 gig or 256. If they're apparently the same size as this, that's really, really awesome. And uh, I don't know if I should waste this. What do you guys think? Should I plug this inside a computer or inside my camera and see if it still recognizes it? Or you guys think this is pretty much garbage now? So you guys let me know in the description below if you guys have already known this all the way back or you're, it's a surprise to you guys. It's definitely a surprise to me. I've never seen this before. But yeah, this should be it for this video, guys. I'm going to be giving you guys a few more updates of my camera, see how it goes. If not, I'm going to have to purchase a brand new camera. If they can fix it, very cool. If not, you guys should be expecting a video in the next couple days. Um, again, this is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Peace out.